my name is Eileen Perez, I'm an astrophysicist, and this is Why Do Stars in the Night Sky Change with the Seasons? So this has to do with the orbit of the Earth around the Sun. So let's say that you have the Sun here in the center, and we're in this position, let's say that this is you know, vernal equinox, so we're in the spring. Well, this is the daytime, so that means that the people who are seeing the nighttime, whoever's experiencing the nighttime, can see only this way, right? So let's say that Pegasus is here. Okay, let's say that in this area of the sky we have Orion, in this part of the sky we have Leo, and in this, in this part of the sky we have Lyra. So uh, three months later, we are in this position, we have a completely different season, and it's just kind of the same idea. Here you have daytime, in the nighttime, can only be can only see this direction so you're now seeing Orion now you move six months from now you're in your autumnal equinox and is the same idea this is daytime so nighttime that means you can see this part of the sky that means you will have Leo and if you move to your last one three months later you have Lyra in your night sky so as you can see every three months or so we're at a completely different place in the orbit meaning that we can look at a different part of the sky depending on where we are. My name is Eileen Perez, I'm an astrophysicist, and this is how stars change depending on seasons. Mm -hmm.